Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me and welcome back to Arc Genesis. Okay guys, well if you didn't know, by fixing the glitches in the game, the purple spires that you're going to see are, that are going to be around the maps, you're going to be able to gain hexagons, which are going to allow you to get uh, rewards to use in the store. And we're going to go ahead today, I'm going to show you you're keen to spend yeah exactly what i'm going to do is I'm, i have enough hexagons now we're going to be able to buy one of each of the loot crates that are available we have a red we have a yellow or an orange and we have a green so the red one is forty-five thousand. the orange one is twenty-five thousand, and the green is ten thousand. question is are they worth it I don't know. We're going to find out. By the way, in this store, man, they've got they've got some useful stuff here. They don't have all of the useful things that I'd like to see, but you know what? That's me. Uh, if you are looking for element, you can pick up element right here for 2,000 uh, hexagons a pop. That's going to be two of the glitches. You're going to fix two glitches. for You get 1,000 1, hexagons per glitch that you fix. Plus, every now and again, H and HLNA will, uh, will ask you to say hello and, uh, when you go to a new biome. Or every so often, she'll ask you to say hello, and it'll give you 300 hexagons as well. All right, so I have I have quite a few. I got enough for one of each of these loot boxes. Let's go ahead and let's Welcome test it out. Hexagon exchange. All right, let's go ahead and let's uh, let's let's buy a green one. Let's go ahead and buy. Oh, and it already told me. Hang on. She's now, a survivor. All right, for the green one, I got a blueprint for ram trackle metal sickle. I got a cross primitive crossbow, and I got a Primitive metal sickle blueprint. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and grab an orange one for twenty-five thousand. Man, that's a lot. That's twenty-five uh, glitches you gotta you gotta get. So you got I got oh I got a tier two loot crate. Wait, no 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 no. Okay, that was a tier two loot crate. Let's see what it gave me. So it gave me stone. It gave me cementing paste. 95 element dust, one focal chili, and eight cooked meat jerky. That's, that's, are you, are you serious, really? Uh, for some reason, when I'm playing around on like one of the, or a couple of the biomes, I'm getting element dust like natively. It's like I'll get element dust in my, in my inventory every now and again. I get three, four, five, and it'll build up over time. So like, especially in the winter biome, it seems like I'm getting that. So I don't know what the deal is with that. Maybe it's a glitch. Maybe it's 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 intentional. I don't know. But that I I don't feel like that's worth it. What they gave me. So let's go ahead and get rid of this stuff here, just so we can get an accurate count. I, I want to make sure I know what we're gonna have for the uh, for that that final loot crate because I, so far I'm not feeling like this is worth it at all. Welcome to the Hexagon Exchange. All right. So and finally for the forty five thousand hexagon price the red loot crate boom all right i got a blueprint for tech boots hang on a second she a survivor. are we getting tech tech stuff now are we able to are we able to even use these at the tech replicator okay so a blueprint for armor 305 hypothermic 13 durability 413 okay so a little better i guess 60 polymer 13 cooked meat jerky 33 black pearls 52 scrap metal ingots, two metal foundations, two spike walls, metal spike walls, two stone walls, three stone foundations, two metal pillars, and a metal dinosaur gateway, which I guess you can break these down. You know what? Let's, let's put this, let's see if I can break this down. They had done a, a change on some of this stuff where you couldn't break some stuff down for rewards. Let's see if I can break this down. Oh, I can't even move. I can't even move right now. Let's go ahead and put down these pillars. If I can break these down for resources, that'd be fine. Yeah, it looks like you can, so that's fine. So we can pick up some cementing paste this way. I'm gonna go into uh, creative mode so I can move. Yeah, you can get cementing paste and some metal ingots that way. So, you know, breaking that stuff down, we got 159 metal ingots, plus there's so 200 metal ingots, you know, some cementing paste. The black pearls are cool. Is it worth it? I don't think so. I think they should have left the uh, the drops in the game, but that's just me. You know, I'd rather, now that I know what, it, what what I'm getting, or what I, you know, what little I got, I'd much rather go and spend my, my hexagons on, on cryopods, to be honest. 
to be completely honest with you, I'd rather just have cryopods. But you know what? Why don't you tell me what you think in the comment section, guys? I'd appreciate you. I'd like to know your opinion. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope that was enlightening to you. I hope you learned something. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you, and we'll see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.